Oh. Good morning. Good morning, guys. Welcome to another vlog. Welcome to a little workout session this morning. Nice and early, not early enough. We've, as I said in the last vlog, I think, I <laughs> just see Lucy working hard on her abs in the background. As I think we said in the last vlog, our morning routine shot to pieces, to be honest with you. We, um, we're getting up later, finding it harder, or me anyway, Lucy's a bit better. <laughs> Lucy's a bit better than me, but I'm finding it pretty hard to find the motivation to work out. So, I thought this morning, don't give myself a choice, just get up, do it. How are you guys doing? We hope you're doing well. This lockdown has, this is the hardest lockdown so far. I don't know why, I don't know what it is. I think because last year it was kind of like, no one knew when it was gonna end, no one knew when it was gonna blow over. But and now, the whole world was in it as well. And the whole world was in it, but feeling a little bit harder this time, to be honest. Um, wanna keep it real with you guys, wanna tell you how we're really feeling and what we're really doing. The, the, the vlogs recently, have we've been doing the best we can. It's just been like in the apartment. There's not a lot we can do, so we've been trying to make a video every day, um, whatever we've been up to. Hugely thankful, I was reading through some lovely, lovely comments last night of you guys um, still enjoying the vlogs, still watching the vlogs, so we're so, so grateful for you. It means the world to us, it really, really does. Whew. Gonna need some coffee in a minute. Gonna finish off this workout, we'll get ready, we'll get shot. Actually, we're gonna go out for a walk, we're gonna take you guys out. I know, I know, we're gonna leave the apartment. It's very, very exciting, so let's head out. We love walking up in this area. This is kind of like a dog walking area, but it's pretty quiet today. Usually some cats around here as well that Lucy likes to see and talk to. I'm wearing way too much stuff on my face, but hopped into Real Foods, picked up some coconut water and also cacao nibs. Been missing these recently. Yeah. They got the music on this morning. It's got like a club in here. Can you hear that music? Thank you very much, thank you. Okay, to the right of us here is something coming very, very exciting. We kind of can't believe that this is in BGC. Yeah, it's exciting. We've been to this in Bohol and in Chargao. And it's a good, it's a very cool place. And I think it's exactly what is needed on this roundabout here. Yes. Shaka, coming soon. Let's put some clips in. Yeah, yeah, we'll put some clips in of our previous Shaka yeah. Island I, experiences. I just can't wait to be sat here on a little table with the nice view on like a Sunday morning or something. Yeah, yes, oh man, it's gonna be so nice. It's an incredibly, incredibly nice day, clear blue sky. It's like we're on an amazing island. Well, we are on an amazing island. Island vibe. We're coming, we're coming for a quick breakfast at Shaka. Yeah. And then today we're doing the sardine run, which we haven't done before. Lucy and I have been to Mobile once before. <laughs> So Mike and I are on a little coffee mission. Thank you. Thank you very much. Enjoy it. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Curious George with his bananas. <laughs> yeah. It did say April, but we're guessing it's going to be a little bit delayed. But how cool is that? If you've ever been to Shaka, comment below. If you've never been, then comment below as well and tell us. But this is awesome, we're very excited. They do smoothie bowls, the coffee's usually pretty good. Okay, we're very excited for this to open. I hope it's not delayed too much. Yeah. Coconut water is the way forward. I miss the days of traveling the islands in the Philippines. Fresh buco, fresh coconut every morning. For now we have to deal with drinking it out of a plastic container, but it's not quite the same, but still very, very good. Oh, 
can't beat that. I read somewhere that it's actually better hydration than water. We've got dressed up, it's Friday night. Yeah, man. So we thought we'd get dressed up, go around the corner from our place uh, to this little Japanese restaurant, order some food. We've got some California maki here. And we're actually, we've never sat here before outside. Obviously, restaurants are only open outside at the moment. And it's got a really nice uh, little seating area. You can see the light on me now. It's like wet, it's like sunset time. And it's just a really nice little spot to sit on. And you can just see Burgos Circle from here. People out walking their dogs, people out for a little Friday night, Friday evening stroll. But it's just a really nice spot to come out and just chill and relax. And we've had quite a productive day today, but it has been obviously all indoors, apart from my little walk this morning. So it's nice to have some fresh air and just enjoy this neighborhood for not much longer. I know. <laughs> we won't be living here for much longer. Really, pretty much just around the corner. Yeah. Can I um, twist this about yeah. you? Oh, look at that. Are you in it? Yeah, and so is the sunset, but also so is the parasol. So yeah, it's funny how like the small things, coming out for dinner, we used to go out for dinner all the time, but coming out for dinner, sitting outside, watching the world go by, thanks Luce, um, is now something of a bit of a novelty, a little bit exciting for us, but we're gonna tuck in. We've ordered some other stuff, katsu curry, some nice sushi, and what was the other thing? Chicken teriyaki. And this is the first time in weeks that we've been out for food. Oh no, that's a lie. Went to Manam, didn't we? For dinner, for dinner. So nice to be out, we've pretty much finished off the curry already. <laughs> and now we're gonna have some of this, some of this teriyaki chicken. Very no, teriyaki nice. toki? Tori, which Tori. is chicken in Japanese. Mm. We may be home, but the meal is not over. We've come home for dessert. We're gonna have some of that Japanese ice cream from Karamu. You might have seen this in the last vlog. We tried the chocolate flavor. This is the caramel. Very, very, it's melting, so I need to go. Very, very excited to try that, delicious. Um, we're gonna leave this one off here, guys. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you enjoyed the vlog today. Thanks so much for watching, checking in. Looks like I've got my old short hair back. I don't, Lucy's just tied it up. But this is like old George right now with the black cap. Another episode of Line of Duty lined up for us. And we've had a good day today, we've had a good day. We've been saying that this lockdown has been, we're struggling with it a little bit more, to be honest, um, than the previous lockdowns, but today has been good. We did a workout, we went for a morning walk, we grabbed a morning coffee, we went out for some dinner, watched a little bit of a sunset, had some nice food, come home, a little bit of Netflix, a little treat with some ice cream, and we checked in with you guys, as we love to do. So thank you so much for sticking around, thank you for watching till the end. If you did watch till the end, leave a comment, I wanna know you guys, special thanks to you guys. And that's it, we're gonna see you very, very soon in the next vlog. Any final words? Um, I spilled soy sauce down my dress. You did, didn't you? Yep, that happened. I All hoped right. it wouldn't, but it did. Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs>